welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I have a special video about this um, Apple Pig Leather Art, I love their logo, um, wallet slash um, Hobonichi Weeks cover. So you can use it as a wallet, you can put your cards in here. Um, I'll show you an unboxing that I did because I wanted to get it out of the box on Saturday and we went to the beach, that's why I look a little red. Um, yeah, I didn't. I literally went like this with the spray and people, you need to spray it and then kind of lather it. So any part where I didn't spray, I have like weird, like one line that's red here, one line that's red here. Amateurish. But um, yes, I diverge. Um, diver yes. And so I was going to talk to you about this. I also went to the Hobonichi meetup and I have one photo of the stack. That's it. Rowena from Sojourner took some photos. Hopefully she'll post them. Uh, but I didn't. I took the stack and that's it. But yeah, I'm going to go over this um, by showing you the unboxing. And then I'll come back and tell you my thoughts. the unboxing at first you know I'm usually not a super fan of big stuff especially I've tried like when I did the traveler's notebook I was trying to basically um, have one, everything in one spot and it was too big I'm sorry somebody's hammering outside the difference here is it's really a uh, flush so you really just I mean it's not much bigger there's a spot for the pen and this is a pretty big pen but you could put bigger you know there's room um, there's the magnet closure which i really like it smells like apples which is really strange it smells like apples to me it's apple pig leather art and as you saw it came with another sample maybe if you can see the leather you'll see how it is and then I had asked him for red elastic and he put an extra one and in fact let me show you what I did with the other elastic if I can find which purse I put it with me in so don't mind the mess 
again we went to the beach Saturday and we kind of I still have to go through everything so I put like the extra cards like loyalty cards mainly um, around I put that elastic around it and I put it like this but I think his logo is really really cute I'm gonna put his Etsy shop it's a little bit the same deal as hand stitch leather art um, lens stitch leather tea Etsy shop which is he's kind of a one-man show and so it takes him a while I will put his Facebook group because you'll get a lot of answers and you'll get a lot of pictures of what other people have because it's very customizable customizable I think that's right it's hot in here I'm a little bit out of it I spent about an hour on the hold with the DMV so um, I love it <laughs> that's a surprise yesterday when I left with it so I had it all Saturday I'll post a picture of me taking a picture of it at the beach but um, Sunday I wasn't quite sold and by the end of the day Sunday I was like this actually really works the only thing that I'm bummed out about is I know I want a cardboard um, cover and I'd like to just have the cover on cover and I don't know if it's going to fit or not in there I don't know there's I think you could probably ask for more room um, I'm sure because you can customize everything but I love that you have like room to put stickers back here then you have the zipper you know I have cash in there the pen of course um, and then you have one, two, three, four, five, six car slot, and then you can put some bales or some other stuff in there, and a pocket in here. So you can even uh, kind of, you can't actually, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm gonna, I was gonna say something and that's wrong. You cannot put this in there. You can't use it as a folio, and there is no opening on the other side. That would be actually, you know, if I were to change one thing, maybe I would do that, just put, a pocket um, in here but you can probably ask for one and make it almost like an option to have it at almost as a folio so you could just have one in there but honestly I really love it it really smells like apples I almost want to email him and ask him if he sprays apples on this leather it's almost gone now but when I first got it I was like it smells different and then I realized it smells like apple and it's weird because it's apple pig leather art so I wonder but yeah I really like it um, I really wanted to try some red leather and I almost forgot <laughs> that I had this coming and I almost order um, another Hemingway um, but like the Milan I think is the red one in weeks and I'm glad I didn't because I don't usually like having the same um, covers in different sizes I've noticed like I like having you know, I like having this, this, and my Sojourner um, for my illustrated art um, journal. This hammering is really hard to ignore. So yeah, that's all. I don't have anything new otherwise. The Hobonichi meetup was really fun. Um, I gave away some of my old washi tape that's not... Um, in the giveaway because the giveaway I'm giving sticker packs that have been unopened I did not post the giveaway yet I had done the video and the reason is I have my art fair next week and I don't want to have that at the same time so I'll probably post it right before the art fair if I have time if there's no last minute thing so that it ends afterwards so that as soon as I have a winner I can go mail it I hate it uh, I hate sitting on stuff uh, that needs to be mailed but I also want to be able to put my whole um, head into it and I still want to do a better package because the first giveaway is just going to be a watercolor uh, set and a little book with really nice paper and yeah well um, I probably will post that next week that's my goal is to post it at the beginning of the week because Thursday I'm on art fair mode until Sunday um, I'll probably be on art fair mode before but I can I ha can take the time to do a little video to show you uh, what's in the first giveaway this one will just be watercolor and it comes with a water brush a pen inside and a little book and that's it and then the rest will be stickers I'll probably throw pens here and there because I have so many of them and they're all new um, and then 
a lot of stickers and then some stamps so yeah that's next week in the meantime thanks for listening to my rumble i hope um you got a good idea of it about this it's really because i saw some videos and i think somebody just posted a video about this but this is the notebook number four i think in red velvet and honestly you know why i started loving it it's because you pay at the store and then i see my hobonichi weeks and it makes me happy <laughs> it was really strange but that is what changed my mind like yesterday i was at the hobonichi meetup and i was like I don't know it's a little bulky for me then I took it out and I realized it's not that bulky this has everything and then the extra like all the and this is a pokeball place I like to go to all these like cards that usually like make your wallet super bulky I just put that elastic around it and put it in the pocket of my purse and honestly I love it I really love it oh I wanted to talk about uh, my choices for the Hobonichi covers I think I'll do it in a different video because then I'll incorporate um, the screenshot because I don't remember the names so I will do that in a couple of days thanks for watching and I hope everyone had a great weekend sorry for the mess behind me it's even worse right here um, because there's boxes with the underwater photo shoot stuff and everything that I need to put away so I'm going to be doing that right now and I hope you guys are having a lovely Monday and I'll post another video hopefully this week and definitely on Saturday morning my plan with me. Thanks, bye bye.